Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Total War Warhammer 2 Vampire Counts Let's Play. I am the Alchemical Rabbit, and today we continue anew. I think last week went very well. How about you guys down in the comments? Alright, so I have taken a little bit of time before this level to look around my current situation, because it's been about a week since I was playing, and I have come to realize that while things went well, last week we do have a threat on our border and I need to turn my attention to it actually immediately so if we go back up here we can see the dwarves in the mountain range up here you can see on the mini map they are getting a little strong so you can see the amount of territory they're holding I am, I think I'm going to turn Manfred's attention down there and remove them while we wait on Vampiric Corruption to actually finish everything else off. That is the best idea, because we could go for Essen right now and take it. The problem is that's going to piss all these humans off. They're going to come for us. We are already at war with... We have to war... No, they are at war with Moot. So they may end up just weakening each other if we leave them alone. We could swing over and try and capture this city, the problem is between the mountain range and the river, that's going to take like forever. So instead, we are going to head down south and start weakening these dwarves. We need to capture them outside the city, of course. We'll see how that ends up going. We'll take out Oakenhammer first. It's a tier 1 city, only has half a stack to... Two vampire boys should be enough. We are hoping. Let's get everyone as close as possible, please. All right. Meanwhile, you continue on your never-ending journey to come down here and visit some uh, some bad lands. Uli, you are good. We are still not doing great on money, most because we have no trade. However, we are two turns away from our income jumping. I just don't want to get a third army until that. Next turn, though, we turn our attention to Oakenhammer. Okay, Zufbar just went to war with the Border Princes. That means they have even more things on them. Okay, Orcs are coming. That is fine. All right, one more turn, and we will have free skeletons. Yeah, so we'll have a free skeletons. We'll need to make sure we get that for the extra strength. And then we're going to be able to just start uh, pumping out free armies outside of lords. And that will hopefully work. Might be a terrible idea. We're going to find out. All right. Drakenhof is ready to level. Definitely get that going immediately. Get the next gold, next gold mine going. All right, this place. Oh, it's so clean. Disgusting. All right, we are actually... Yeah, we'll lead with Manfred. Declare the war. We have very high reliability. Of course we do. We're Manfred. Reliably at war. All right, we can control a large army. It's pretty one-sided. What am I worried about losing? Nothing. All right, let's just do that. Yeah, we're fine. We lost any of the zombies. That is cool. Occupy, get in there. Alright, so they are now going to be at war with both the Border Princes and me, and we've just broken one of their territories. That is good. Meanwhile, public order... That's right, you can't just drop an immediate uh, corruption, can you? Alright, well, just more income. Let's just generate more money you are looking good we do have enough movement to get you back into the home territory yeah, you'll, you'll regenerate a hell of a lot more out there uh, right here we don't want this zombie unit they can go away oh we're actually broke that's fine I'm getting the level sorry uh, getting the level on um Drakenhof, so we'll actually get the next level of gold mine. Sorry, wasn't thinking there. All right, so for over here, Gaze of Agash, Gaze, oh, 
these guys are worth it in a lot of ways because if as soon as I can get Wind of Death and Arcane Conduit, all of these necromancers are going to be worth it. So rather than be vampires, I admit, but hey, what are you going to do? Uh, research rate. I think we're just going to go with Curse of Undeath for now and start working towards that. Good bit of leveling for everyone, including Manfred. Purple Sun, Invocation. Yeah, so we are definitely going to go with the Lore Master of Vampires. Do we want that yet? No, we don't have Lightning Strike. We need Lightning Strike before anything else. Holy crap, I'm glad I saw that. Um, Passability Master... Uh, spell never used for raised it. Oh. Pretty good. We will definitely be getting to that eventually. For being able to summon more units. But it is not that day yet. We just want to get everybody working towards arcane conduits, except for some of these lords who just need more experience in general. All right, Oakenhammer is dead. Zufbar, threatening but not terrible. The bigger problem is the city garrison. We'll probably have to fight that one. All right, the gold mine is done. Let's finish this and see what our income goes to once all of our skeletons become free. Alright, getting to know the Badlands a little bit. Don't even remember what quest it was that he needed to go do. Belight Water, I need to visit Belight Water. Okay. For 1,500 monies? Hey, we need it. Alright, so the Greenskins, who have not received their update as of this recording doing okay in the southern lands that's good and boom an extra 2,000 gold per turn because suddenly all of our skeletons have gotten free yeah we can see suddenly yeah upkeep on these armies just plummeted three turns all right you're gonna need a turn or two to regen so are you we're just gonna head back into Drakenhof in case the dwarves decide to do something silly uh, looking good. Ray's dead. We don't have anything good in this area. We are starting to get Grave Guard, though. Now, the problem with actually having any Grave Guard is they cost money. Versus nothing. And nothing is, of course, better than something. Now, how much are we sacrificing? We're sacrificing a lot for free. Uh, we may change that, that attitude a little later in the game, but we'll see. We'll see. All right, you are growing good in one more turn. I can get you up another tier. All right, things are going well. We can keep these dwarves off balance and maybe uh, just secure this this orange territory. I know it's orange, I know, but gotta get something. All right, let's get those skeletons stronger, as dumb as that is. All right, so the White King, uh, let's go ahead and just since you're so far away, get specialists on you. Uh, where are we trying to get you again? Blightwater is apparently here. Is this enough? Yes. Boom. Win the following battle. What is this one? Ah, goblin fight. Lots of doom divers. In that case, we want to make sure we have plenty of flying units before we take that one. But it does give us more money. Good, good. Zufbar, yeah, you're not super happy. I'm not super surprised. All right. You I am assuming this is probably why people don't like the Manfred campaign as much. I wonder how much sitting around because of vampire corruption and sort of waiting for things to stabilize you have to do. But don't worry, don't worry. Thankfully, with our free Skella boys... And just a few more buildings finished. Okay, that's a bigger problem, actually. Do we turn our attention and immediately start fighting the dwarves? I think we have to. Like, we cannot leave this area just sitting here. So, with that in mind, if we go here, we can start raiding. Yeah, that'll give us some more money. I am tempted to go deal with this other city. He can fall back towards it there. All right, so... We're going to start moving out. 
We're actually going to go into ambush stance with the goal of catching them if they try to loop through here, because I'm hoping they don't see him. Darkness comes. We are going to try a trick. We'll only try it for one turn. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. Okay, good. That's all going. Meanwhile, over here, let's keep this settlement growing. Yes, that looks good. Meanwhile, all of our necromancers leveled up again. Okay, in the gash. Uh, Ray's dead. Yeah, let's just start pushing into Ray's dead. I mean, they're necromancers. They don't have Ray's dead. What are they? Uh, you start heading back north, because I can. All right. With... That's secure. We are now actually pulling in an income. We're going to let that sit for a few turns, let that build up before we get a third army. Probably just a skeleton army, just to basically throw things at the walls and absorb Jordan's shot. Good. It looks like our orky friends to the side have uh, been doing well for themselves. We should actually talk to the Lady Spears. They can hold the mountains if they want them. Okay, they didn't take that bait. That's fine. Let's see. We have no problems with each other. We have non-aggression. We will keep that. Meanwhile, Manfred. You can't move while in ambush. Of course, that makes sense. All right. Raiding stance. Oh my god, you suck at moving through this area. Move. Can we just... Ugh. All right, we're going to stay. We are not corrupted, at least. Okay, I thought we were taking a bunch of attrition through here, but I think because of his levels, we're not. So he's going to keep pushing towards Karag. I don't think I'm close enough for him to catch me there. Uh, Ulai. Uli. Get an Oaken Hammer in case this dwarf gets a funny idea. Um, meanwhile, over here, we can finally get access to Necromancers. Well, isn't that just lovely? Okay, that's doing well. Still sitting on 3,000 money, which for right now is not the worst thing in the world. Head back north, Sigvald. Yeah, this is the only army that has me concerned right now. All right, there we go. Um, the Greenskins have completely confederated at this point. Sterland and Averland are now punching each other, so I don't really have to worry about that flank nearly as much. Okay, okay, things are still holding. Hello. Can I help you? Cool, non-aggression with the savages. They are happy with it. And because I don't really want them around the gold mine, immediately just get that sucker building. What is this? A weakened battlefield. Okay. Okay, not bad, not bad. Anything over here we want? Yeah, I think we definitely need to start getting vampire corruption spreading into the human territories. Probably should have started that a while ago. Ready. All right. The army has appeared. How do we feel about that? Not well. Not well. That's macabre. Hmm. If he wants to throw armies up here, that means he's not protecting his other stuff. <sighs> what? That's an army I think we might be able to take. I know, I know, I shouldn't. Should we encircle this? Probably not, probably not. We don't have enough money to be trying anything. These dwarves are defending against us better than I wish they would. I think we have to be aggressive. I think we just need to push. Darkness comes. Do we push on Zuthbar? It's a tier three. My axe thirsts for war. All right, we're gonna push. You know what? I know I've wasted a lot of turns. We're gonna take Zuthbar. We're gonna take Zuthbar. Holy. I wasn't. I was really hoping because of the uh, other wars that the dwarves are fighting, they weren't going to be able to pull an army up to take that settlement. Dwarves. 
Would that Nagash had wiped thy sorry race out when he had the wherewithal to do so. Speak then. Oh, that was rude. You want peace? Um, sure, buddy. I have not even encountered you, really. That's one less dwarf I have to worry about. Yes. Black Venom is gone. Alright, the skeletons are now stronger. We now have a vampire. Yes, my son. Oh. Okay. Well then, that changes things a little bit, doesn't it? With that in mind, what are we trying to build around here? Nothing here, nothing here. We already have that. We don't want that building. We could potentially use that. We are already building all of those. So we are actually going to hold off on that for now and instead focus on getting a shady township set up. Yes. Is that worth it? Is that worth it? Is that worth it, I ask you, ladies and gentlemen? I think that it is. Getting Waldenhof leveled up will help with the future war against the Humans. So, so he is in position to run an attack. You are not yet. Can we get here? Yes, and not take anything. So, I just realized he's in March stance. That was dumb, but so we'll just protect him. If they wrap all the way around for Oakenhammer, well, what am I going to do? Uh, Hinder Replenishment is useless. Sure, let's damage a building. I'll watch this vampire die on the very first move. Failed. Oh, well. She didn't die, though. She didn't die, so we're going to call that a victory for, for this case. He's going to head up this way. I think, until we go into zombies... That one's not bad, Vigor Loss Reduction, but... Crypt Ghouls, Cairn Wraiths, Movement is always good. I'm not using a lot of them yet. Dire Wolves and Fell. Alright, let's start upping the actual Empire. I think that's where we're gonna go. Yep, alright. The Dami and the Book of the Blood. Love it. That's true, we have very little research into our actual uh, economy or anything. We just have a bunch of very strong skeletons that drank a lot of milk in their living years. Taken from the fields of the Empire, where they used to raise cattle, you see. Okay, well, that orc went ahead and grabbed that human territory I said I wasn't going to take. See how that works out for him. All right, Castle Drakenhof. You are looking a little better now. We have Vampire Corruption starting to flow out. I think we're just going to get this. That will help with corruption and everything else. Meanwhile, Tempelhof has actually leveled. How about that? What do we think is actually worth putting in here, though? No, that can go into a lesser building, so I don't think it's necessary around here. Wow, Castle Tempelhof kind of sucks. Um... Do we just wait and get the Awakened Battlefield? I think we're just going to wait and get the Awakened Battlefield. Alright. So, with that in mind, is there anything you can build that's worth it? Not really. Which means we turn our attention instead to one man, Fred. Alright, buddy. You get over here. We do not have time to take attrition. We are pushing fast. Against the dwarves. They are weakened, and I think most of their armies are up here. If we can crush them, they will be far, far less of a problem. Alright, the garrison looks nasty, but I think we can push through. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we will next time. If you have enjoyed, please be sure to like, subscribe, and share. Until next time, I have been the Alchemical Rabbit, and I will see you later.